Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Denise Marie. And so today I'm going to be sharing some thrifted decor that I have picked up um, here and there over the past couple of months. And if you follow me on Instagram, you might have seen some of these pieces, but I am really excited to share them with you and give you some home decor inspiration. So the first find I'm going to be sharing is from Goodwill. And most of my items are actually from Goodwill. That's the main thrift store um, that I do usually visit. There are a couple of others, but Goodwill seems to be the place where I find most of my uh, decor. So the first one I'm gonna be sharing with you is this beautiful basket. And this one actually, is not from Goodwill, but I actually um, thrift this one from a garage sale, and it was here in my neighborhood. Somebody was selling it for two dollars, and I saw it, and I just knew that I had to have it. I thought that it was so pretty. I love the different um, colors that it shows. It kind of shows two different variations of of a uh, light and dark here. And so I just knew that it was something that would go great with my decor. I was not too sure what I was going to use it for at first, but I am actually using it in my um, kitchen. I'm actually using it on my dining room table and I have filled it with um, some real fruit and I plan on filling it with some um, filler as well, but I love this and it was $2. So my next find you may have also seen on uh, my Instagram is going to be this beautiful print that I found at Goodwill. This was actually a recent find um, and this says Be Still. Um, it has this um, faux plant on here and I just loved it so much. This was, I think it was $4 and it looks like on the back, oh yes, it was $4. I have a habit about leaving my tags on um but this was only four dollars and i just loved the light um or the natural wood and i loved the fact that it reminded me of a scripture it says be still that reminds me of a scripture and so i knew that this would go great on my ledger i'm always changing up my decor on my ledger for the seasons and so this is definitely one of my favorite finds one of my next recent finds is going to be this beautiful, I say beautiful because it's beautiful to me, but um, is going to be this vase that I recently DIY'd. And I really loved the shape of this vase. It reminded me of something that you would find from Studio McGee or even from Heart and Head. And so when I saw it, I didn't really care for the color because it was really dark um, brown and like a yellow but I knew that the shape would go great. So I went ahead and thrifted this as well and turned it into a thrift flip. And this I believe was only three or four dollars as well. And I just, I love the way it came out. I've added some faux greenery to it. I'll show you. And you might have seen this in a recent video of mine as well, but I just added this faux greenery that I had it on hand and I love the way it looks and it just makes a nice neutral um, DIY thrifted decor piece in my home. So, you know, home decor doesn't always have to be super expensive. I know sometimes it can be. My next thrifted decor piece is going to be another basket and I thought this basket was super cute. I had originally purchased it for some wall decor but I didn't think it was going to look really cute on my wall after all and so after um, just kind of having it, having it there I figured out um, another way to incorporate it and this makes such a cute piece. If you have faux IKEA plants this goes perfect. This is a faux plant from IKEA and look how well it fits in there and I just loved it. I knew that it would be super cute and this was actually, I still have the tag on there. Oh my gosh, it's actually falling off so I should probably take it off. But this I believe was actually, a, I don't know if you can see it, it was like a $1.09. Um, but yeah, I, I love this. I love that it is very uh, neutral and I love the 
um, texture and this would be great for I think you could use it any time of the year I plan on possibly I plan on using it for spring so I'm really loving the way this looks and you can even of course change out the floral so there's another idea for you my next thrifted decor is going to be this cute little vase this vase I actually found um, last year at Goodwill and I just thought it was super cute and I actually did not want to DIY this. It has something on there already, but I loved the color. If you look at that color, I love the color of the vase and I thought it would make another great addition to my thrifted decor. This, I don't have the sticker on here anymore, but I believe it was probably $1.99 or even just $1.09 because usually I try to keep my thrifted decor, you know, pretty low if I can. So another favorite thrifted decor piece that I have found is going to be this beautiful, beautiful tray. And I love the color. It is a copper color. Um, and when I saw this, I knew that I had to grab this as well. Um, I knew this would make another addition to my home. Um, I could definitely find different areas to put it in. And honestly, I use this year round. Um, I actually use this in my kitchen. If you've seen any of my previous videos, then you definitely have probably seen it in my decor. This is originally from Target. I don't know if you can see that. I might have it upside down but this is actually originally from target it is a project 62 piece um i think i got this for maybe three dollars so another goodwill find of mine is going to be you guessed it another basket i love finding baskets from goodwill looking for baskets at the thrift store they are such an easy and inexpensive find if you are definitely looking to do a boho uh, wall basket type of decor goodwill or any thrift store would be um, the best place to go if you're trying to do it on the um, cheap side just because they have so many different options that you can find you never know what you're going to find there and so this was definitely another one of my favorites and i've actually used this in videos before so that's another favorite a thrifted decor piece of mine my next thrifted decor piece is going to be this really cute planter that I found and this was actually a recent find for me. This is not something for myself um, but this is something that I found for my daughter. I just thought it was super super cute and I still have the sticker on there. I'm actually trying to take it off but this was only like two dollars I believe and it has these cute little adorable feet on there and I just thought that it would make a cute little addition to my daughter's room. I actually plan on putting a possibly an air plant or maybe some al aloe in there. Um, just to make a cute little addition to her room. So one of my next favorite thrifted decor finds is going to be actually two pieces and it is going to be these cute pots that I found um, at Goodwill. These actually had, I don't know if you can still tell, but it had some plants on there and I wanted to go ahead and get these because of the texture I don't know if you can see the texture but I did actually spray paint these so I did turn these into a little bit of a DIY thrift flip and all I did was do just do a couple of coats of spray paint and I got it this nice neutral tone and this is actually the big pot and then this is going to be the little pot that goes with it um, I have been using this as decor in my home as well. I actually do not put any type of filler in them. I just use them as they are. But this year I am going to change them up a little bit and I have actually decided to possibly put some holes on the bottom. And I'm going to use these as some spring decor for my backyard. Um, I wanted to kind of give my backyard a little bit of sprucing up for spring. And so I thought these would make a great addition. I'm not gonna actually plant pots in there, so I may not even need to put holes. Um, I planned on putting some pots in there and just using them um, as planters, but I really, really love these. They were another find of mine, and these were actually, like I said, they were two pieces. So this was $4.99. Again, I still have the tag. And this one was $3.99. 
So my last favorite thrifted decor piece is going to be a recent find. Um, like I said, if you follow me on Instagram, I actually shared this over there as well. And this was um, definitely a favorite find of mine. I wasn't really looking for it when I found it, but when I saw it, I thought it would make a great addition as well. I've definitely been seeing a lot of um, decor inspiration like this on Pinterest, on um, at Target, you know, different um, decor stores. And so this is the last decor piece that I'm going to be sharing. I just thought it was super, super cute. Um, and it is a candle holder, I guess, or you could say like a candelabra. Um, this was only, I left the tag on there so y'all could see, but this was only $3.99 and it is going to be a um, thrift flip as well. I'm definitely going to be giving them an updated look so that they could match my decor a little more and i really love them i do need to find some candles for them that's why i don't have anything in there yet i'm just kind of putting it off to the side for now but i really love it and i cannot wait to style these in my home so that is all of my thrifted decor and i hope that you really found some inspiration i hope that if you um, do go to the thrift stores you find some good finds as well definitely leave me a comment down below if you have gone if you do enjoy going what is your favorite thrift store what has been your favorite find and also if you like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up um follow me on instagram at home and i will see y'all in the next video bye